Hello everyone, thank you for taking the time to join us for 21 days of prayer to jumpstart your year and jumpstart your day. Um, I'd like to look at John chapter 17 and verse six today. It says, um, and this is Jesus talking. He says, I have manifested your name to the men whom you have given me out of the world. They were yours, you gave them to me, and they have kept your word. Now they have known that all things which you have given me are from you. For I have given to them the words which you have given me. Talking to his father, Father God. And he says, and they have received them, received them and have known surely that I came forth from you. And they have believed that you sent me. Now I want you to see this in verse 9. He says, I pray for them. I pray for them. I do not pray for the world, but for those whom you have given me, for they are yours. Now, I just want you to, to just see this. He says, I pray for them. Well, who? He's talking about the ones that, that God had brought into his life, the disciples, the one who had followed him, the one whom he had given the word that he had received from his father. He says, I pray for them. Then he says something kind of astounding. He says, I do not pray for the world. Well, clearly we know that Jesus loves the world. He gave his life uh, for us and for humanity uh, to make a way to the Father. So we know that he loves people, but right here he says that his prayer was for those that had been given to him. And so my encouragement for you today is to recognize the people that God has brought into your life. Take the time to look and see and take an account of those who are close to you, the people that God has brought to your life, and take time to pray for them specifically. Call their name out, write their name down, pray prayers for them, pray prayers from, from the book of Ephesians chapter one and Ephesians chapter three, that they would have wisdom and revelation and the knowledge of who God is, that they'd be strengthened with mighty power by the Holy Spirit in their inner man. And, and my prayer is this, is that as you pray for them, of course, I believe others will be praying for you, but, but I believe that those that are around you will be, will be strengthened, will be quickened, will be helped, will be filled, will, will be fruitful in what God has called them to do. And just as Jesus was grateful for those that God had brought to him, be thankful, be grateful for the ones that God has brought into your life and call their name out in prayer. And I believe that they'll be strengthened and they'll be helped today. And at the same time, I believe you'll be strengthened and you'll be helped today. Amen.